All right, everybody, there's been a lot of stuff in the news lately about uh, firearms, shootings, stuff of that nature. Um, there's been a lot of talk of gun control, more laws being passed, uh, the rights that individuals have to carry or not carry, stuff of that nature. Um, here at Ready Tactical, we, uh, we're of the firm belief that criminals, by definition, break the law, okay? Um, any of these shootings that have happened in the past, in the past couple of months, they were criminals, they were breaking the law. Having, having more laws on the books would not have stopped evil people from doing evil things. But what could have stopped evil people from doing evil things were armed citizens, okay? And that's, that's where CCW comes into play and that's where everything else comes into play. And I think, I think the two of you will agree with me on that. Yeah, well, I, I think it's funny. They say, hey, as soon as anything tragic happens, immediately they, they blame the guns. Oh, they had AR-15s, oh, they had pistols, and they had all this... And, you know, we need to make more laws. They shouldn't have ever gotten that gun. Well, it's like, well, they always obtained it illegally anyway. Mm -hmm. It's like they obtained it illegally, um, like with the Sandy Hook tragedy. The guy broke five laws just taking that firearm to the parking lot of that school. And so how would more laws... Wouldn't have done anything. Yeah, so that's where a citizen who knows what they're doing in the right place is is going to be much better than more words on a piece of paper so just marrying off that it's kind of like the how the spoon made rosie o'donnell fat and the pencil how it made me flunk my essay test i have to go on that one <laughs> it's a valid point very valid point yeah. um they've done studies on average in in mass shootings when mass shootings are stopped by a by an armed citizen there's an average of 2.2 deaths um, when mass shootings are stopped by armed police, the people that everybody seems to rely on to protect them, um, it's, it's more than 10 people are killed on average. So clearly, the more people that we have that are trained, armed citizen-wise, uh, roaming about, the, the crime will go down. Um, and you can see that anywhere in the country. You look at the places that have the strictest gun control laws, the crime rate there is going to be the highest. Yep. Um, it's, really, it's really simple, folks. Get out there, get trained, get proficient, get confident with that firearm. Have that, have that defensive mindset that Wicks talked about, and uh, be safe. It's what it takes. So, if you like this discussion, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our YouTube channel, leave us a comment. If you didn't agree with what we said, that's okay too. Uh, leave a comment. We'd love to get a discussion going. I mean, it's okay for people to have different ideas and to put those ideas out in the forum and to, um, you know, debate it out. And uh, let's see what comes of it. But remember, just because you want to say something negative, make sure you got some factual information to back it up because we got some more to back it up for you. <laughs>